Can't do that. Yeah, I was gonna say you can <laughs> not do that. <laughs> do not do that. Yeah. You can Get hug though. You can hug. You can hug. I don't know. Is there a bike here? I just saw that. Okay. All right, we're gonna let you have a second. It didn't take long to realize it was the real deal. They were meant to be and happier than ever. With the woman of his dreams out in his arms, Matt started walking with a little more pep in his step. He had his own hype man, Macy. They've both grown so much as individuals because of each other and more so as a couple, which brings us here today to witness their next step in life. We have heard your promises to share your lives together in marriage. So, by the power vested me in the state of Ohio, it is my pleasure and honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Matthew, kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Matthew Cotter. that's become a brother and someone that I know always has my back. Uh, Macy, I've got 25 years of stories I could tell about you. So I'll save myself the embarrassment. I'll, I'll just wrap this up by saying, here's to Matt and Macy, I'm glad you each found a soulmate, um, someone that's so like-minded and always has each other's backs. So here's to you guys and here's to forever. quite frankly, the most beautiful bride that you have ever laid your eyes on. Coming into today, I knew Macy would be absolutely stunning, but in all honesty, she's beyond stunning. And yes, Matt, of course, you clean up very well and you're not sore to the eyes either. I don't even know where to start with you. As I'm putting the words to paper to best describe you, I scratched it all out and put Macy's perfect soulmate. You're everything she needed and you're everything she wanted. Matt, thank you for bringing back out Macy that we all missed and the happiest I've ever seen her in 10 years. Now let's all raise our glasses for a toast. Mutual freaking weirdness forever. Matt and 